here's the thing. You can't make an informed choice if you don't know what's in your food. When you're shopping at a store, read labels, read labels, read labels. <laughs> that, those are kind of the one, two, and three. It's your body. Figure out what's going into it. Don't let other people tell you what's going to go in your body, you know. The really interesting thing for me is read the number of servings per container, right? So you'll read something and it will have, you know, oh, it's only 100 calories. Yeah, but the 100 calories is only for like two bites, <laughs> you know. So you have to have, um, you have to be able to interpret that. And then when you read the ingredients, they list the ingredients based on how much of that thing is in there. So whatever the first ingredient is, that's the most. And then the next one, and then the next one, which is you know, why I say if sugar is one of the first five ingredients, just put it back on the shelf. Take something like vitamin water. You look at it and you think, oh, it's supposed to be super healthy. But one of the first three ingredients is sugar. You know? And I think a lot of people don't know that there's sugar in there. You know? So they look at it and they, it says water on the label. It, it must be, you know, better than other beverages. And it turns out, as far as the sugar content goes, you know, it may not be that much better. Number one, read labels. Number two, don't be afraid to be picky about what you're putting in your body because you have to live with it.